It often occurs in buildings that there are several pieces of identical equipment. The Zego Control Point offers vast functionality to build operator screens for such equipment. In particular, in order to do so most efficiently, there is a powerful mechanism by which one can create a graphic once and then deploy it on all pieces of identical equipment without additional engineering. Now let's have a look how this can be done for an air handling unit. In the system at hand, as you see, there are two air handling units, one for the east wing and another one for the west wing. If we click on the little icons on the left hand side of these objects, we see bubbles coming up, the top one of which containing a few tags for that object that we have clicked on, in this case AHU, Air, Equip and Plant. And as we click on the air handling unit West Wing, we see that it contains the very same tags. And these tags will now be used to define the binding of the graphic to the objects in the structure. Changing over to the graphics editor, we see that the air handling unit graphic is already opened. And when we hit save, we see that we have the chance to define a graphic on string, which is in this case set to the very same tags that we saw before, equip and air and plant. We hit save and navigate back to the operator screen in order to verify whether this binding worked out for us. So drilling down into the air handling unit east wing, we see that our graphic appears there. And doing the same thing for the air handling unit west wing, we see that our graphic appears there in the very same way. The real challenge is of course not for the graphic to appear in the right place, but for it to connect to the right data points. Let's exemplify the point to graphics binding via the air handling unit's cooling set point. The current values of the cooling set points of the two air handling units can easily be inspected via the control points list view. Navigating there and drilling down into the east wing air handling unit, we see that its current cooling set point is at 25 degrees Celsius. Doing the same thing for the west wing air handling unit, we see that there the set point is currently 24 degrees Celsius, so it's different. Now in order to actually define the binding, we go back to the other tab of the browser, where we have still the graphics editor open with our air handling unit graphic in. And a straightforward way to now um, make a binding from a data point to a component in the graphic is via the Equipment tab, where we can see all the data from the system, where we can navigate, for example, now to the East Wing Air Handling Unit, and we can look up the cooling set point there. Once we've found it, we can grab it and just drag and drop it on the label for the cooling set point, by which a binding is created in the background. However, as we have pulled the set point for cooling from the east wing air handling unit's data structure, this binding is now absolute. So basically, wherever we will open this graphic, it will always show the value of the east wing air handling unit's cooling set point. So what we have to do is we have to make this binding more general. In order to do this, the Zego control point offers us the possibility to create a relativized binding. In order to do this, we need to right click this label for the set point for cooling. We need to go to extras in the context menu and hit relativize, upon which we get a dialog where we can choose to relativize by tags and relativize to the air handling unit of the east wing. And this is actually exactly what we want to do. So we hit apply here, upon which the binding is set up in a relativized manner and the only thing left for us to do is to hit save. And once we have done that, we can go back to the operator screen in order to verify the functionality of uh, what we've done. So we go back to plant view, ventilation and air conditioning plants. We drill down first into the east wing air handling unit and open the graphic there. And once the graphic has opened, we see that its label for the cooling set point shows 25 degrees. So let's do the same thing for the west wing air handling unit. 
we open the graphic there and we see that the label for the cooling set point shows here actually 24 degrees as we have expected. In this case of two identical air handling units, the efficiency you gain by relativized point binding is actually not tremendous. Imagine however having 50 or more identical rooms. Just create one graphic, apply it to all the rooms without additional effort. Plus, in this video we've really only scratched the surface. Just start working yourself and discover the endless possibilities of the Seagull control point. Siemens. Ingenuity for life.